Hello family, how are you? Today I want to talk about uh, how essential oils help to keep the respiratory system clean. So there are three main uh, defense mechanisms in the uh, respiratory system. The first is mucus. Mucus traps dust and pathogens and uh, pathogenic bacteria. The second is scavenger cells that are part of the immune system and that actively uh, look for um, uh, foreign particles and uh, pathogenic bacteria to destroy them. And the third uh, uh, mechanism is uh, the respiratory cilia. The respiratory cilia are very tiny structures that have the shape of uh, hairs or uh, small fingers and that are uh, located in the surface on the surface of the uh, respiratory system and that they are moving continuously in the direction of the beak or the mouth so thanks to this movement they can uh, expel the uh, foreign particles or the bacteria or the dust and uh, they move them along with the mucus so they can be expelled uh, through the beak or the mouth or the nose. So it is very important that the cilia work properly to, in order to keep the respiratory system clean. So there are three factors that impair the normal, the normal functioning of the cilia. The first factor is the presence of a high concentration of ammonia in the environment of the farm. The second factor is the presence of uh, an excessive amount of mucus or a very uh, viscous mucus that uh, would uh, prevent the cilia from moving so they cannot uh, perform their normal cleaning function. And the third factor is uh, the, a viral infection. Viral, in, viral infections normally uh, affect the epithelium of the respiratory system. And uh, when viral, vi virus uh, infect the cells, they would uh, uh, destroy the cilia and they would take days or even uh, up to two weeks to regenerate. So how can we use essential oils to protect the cilia and to enhance their uh, function? Uh, so we have three ways. So some essential oils can uh, increase the speed of uh, the cilia movement up to 20%. So the cleaning process is optimized. Secondly, there are other essential oils that are mucolytic. So it means that whenever there is a mucus accumulation, these essential oils can make the mucus more fluid. So the cilia can move again and perform their cleaning uh, function. And thirdly, uh, there are as other essential oils that can protect the cilia whenever there is a viral infection. Or if the cilia are already damaged, they can uh, stimulate the regeneration of the cilia and speed it up. So in summary, whenever we have uh, respiratory uh, infections or the risk of our respiratory infections, Essential oils can help us to maintain the respiratory uh, system clean and uh, make the animals healthier. Do you use essential oils for uh, respiratory diseases in your farm? Please let us know but by commenting on the video or by sending us an email. Thank you.